The Northern Ireland Science Park has revealed a new name and a major expansion plan. The £100 million project aims to support thousands of jobs and will see the development of new buildings in Belfast and Londonderry. Vicky Hawthorne reports. Formerly the Northern Ireland Science Park, now Catalyst Inc. The rebrand is just the start of the not-for-profit business planning for the future. The campus is a breeding ground for technology startups, with 160 firms and more than 2,500 workers currently on site. The new 10-year expansion plan aims to attract a further 5,000 jobs. Those behind it agree it is ambitious, but Northern Ireland needs to be competitive. Estonia is leading the world of digital, okay? A tiny little country just joined Europe, now leading the world, doing everything digitally far more than anybody else. So little countries can do it, and we can do it too. The danger is if we don't do it, what else are we going to do? Catalyst Inc. also has plans to develop more office space here at its Belfast base close to the Titanic pump house. It hopes to submit a planning application within the next six months, but it also has more advanced plans for more office space in Londonderry. Firms within the knowledge economy are already lining up to move to the sites. Those already there haven't looked back. It has given us the opportunities to take part in events in St James's Palace. We've been in San Francisco. We've been able to work with um, investors and meet investors. The Science Park was set up in 1999. The focus is now on the future. My hope is that uh, you know, using this as a platform, that we achieve those objectives set uh, for the knowledge economy, that we become one of the, uh, the best knowledge economies in Europe by 2030. Research claims that Northern Ireland has one of the fastest growing knowledge economies in the UK. This expansion plan should keep that on track. Vicky Hawthorne, UTV Live, Belfast.